Wow. This looks great, but no sugar, 7%. My name is Xing Ping Zhang. I'm a Sengjie Test Science Technology Fellow leading the global watermelon genetic improvement for Sengjie Test. Well, I grew up from a farm and uh, farming when I was a child. And I went to agricultural school and uh, actually particularly when I started genetics breeding, that was very fascinating. I said, well, that's what I'm going to do. Watermelon is really a healthy fruit. Uh, currently, we identified uh, lycopene, the very strong antioxidant uh, compounds. And that's what you see. If you see a deep red flesh, well, you can actually assume you are eating more lycopenes, these great compounds for your body. 11. Yeah. Please eat more watermelons, it's good for you. <laughs> we created this high quality, high flavor, pure heart watermelon. It's very thin rind, very smooth, and they're about uh, three to five pounds. And it's specifically by this company, Dosinia Farms. Plant breeding is really a very much science and technology driven crop improvement business. So you would need a, a, a full set of skills that uh, particularly the genetics, uh, statistics and whatever other tools or knowledge generated from bioscience. You know, really you wanted to know exactly what the your customer need and well just act like customer if you are you are targeted for consumer well satisfy yourself you know what do you need <laughs> you know what ourself need uh, for a, a piece of fruit you know be good what what it should be and then maybe you should uh, you know we're doing the breeding we act like farmers well what how we can get get a good crop and then you know also if we are handling the fruit from our field to lab, well, act like a shipper. What is needed <laughs> to, 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 uh, to ensure high quality from a field to the shelf of uh, you know supermarket? Think about the watermelons. If without a plant breeding, we'll be eating a, a, a piece of fruit hot like a rock, and as well as bit, well, it's so big you could not even stand. I mean. It's, it will be actually a big piece of fruit, not juicy and not uh, sweet at all. And with an uh, ever increasing number, you know, population, we're talking about uh, 9 billion people, 2050. <laughs> and uh, actually this gives uh, a, a, a huge challenge for plant breeders. We, we have, uh, you know, fixed a piece of uh, land. You just cannot get more, but only through technology to double the productivity of uh, you know, current agriculture. Plant breeding now faces a, a new challenge, a new opportunity with, uh, the new opportunity is the genomic tools. And uh, be able to, uh, to, to scan, to visual the whole genome and the whole gene, and use those two tools to very effectively to select the genetic variation. That's a great potential. Being a plant breeder, it's an excellent job. 